So here's my seven inch south end shaper. Uh, it's a 110 volt unit. You can just plug it into regular house stuff. Hey, son. Um, let's see here. Everything functions pretty well on it. Yeah, buddy. Uh, the only thing right now that's not functioning is the oiler. Uh, but I got it operating and I've been oiling it manually with uh, my little pump oiler. Um, I haven't been using it a whole bunch because it really needs to come, ago, come apart and get cleaned up. Um, but everything moves freely. Let's slide this way. Uh, this slides for up and down. Uh, device it moves pretty good this machine has been setting up for a while yeah it moves pretty good slide adjustment moves good um, still got the, the guards in good shape it comes up so you can adjust the you pull this lever lift it up loosens the belt so you can adjust the speed on it uh, there's the adjustment for the feed speed on your cutting let's see the clapper it's all in good shape um, let's see oh and there's the, the I guess the, the not what you would call this but it supports the the hip plate, whatever you call that, for when you're cutting. Hey, yeah, bud. Daddy's doing a video, okay? Hmm. Give me just a minute. <laughs> yeah. It's in really good shape. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, here's the... I believe this is a... I guess it was made in the 70s. I don't really know. I hadn't looked it up yet. Um, I think everything on it's all original. The oiler is not working, but I just imagine it's sludged up. It needs cleaning out real good. But everything else is in, I mean, it's in really good shape. I don't know how much it was used in the previous life, but it doesn't seem to be a whole lot. I'm no machinist or anything, but. In fairly well shape. A little twist log there. Um, just needs a good cleaner. So hopefully I can find it a new home. Uh, let's see, I'll fire it up real quick and run it for a second. I don't want to run it too much. I need to clean. But uh Turn it this way, and that gets it to be this way, and you turn it, oh, it's got an arrow on it, that arrow, if you can see that or not, feeds that way, twist it around, feeds this way, feeds that way, now that works, there's the adjustment on your cuts, now this is the switch for the light, and I don't have the light. I've got the bezel somewhere, but that's it. And here's some attachments that come with it. Daddy? I think that's a positioner. Daddy? And another positioner. Which that's a pretty neat little one there. It just, uh, just pops up, up like that, and then pops up. You lock it into place here. Yeah, all this, all these attachments, I don't think were ever used. They were still in the packaging. Uh, there are some, there are some fasteners that go with all that. Uh, some cutters in there. Uh, an angle plate that goes with it, and some wrenches. So, yep, yeah, that's it. And it's, it's got a homemade table. Somebody's done a pretty good job with a homemade table. Pretty heavy machine.
That's it. Thanks for watching.